a little bit after 10 a.m., um, police were called in respect of an incident that happened on Mary Street. Um, a, a person in a nearby shop called and advised police that there was a male who confronted someone with a knife. Um, subsequent investigations have identified that a male and a female were walking down the street. Um, they had seen a male person. Uh, he, um, he stopped, they stopped. The, they will allege that the male person produced a knife. Um, the, as they both turned to flee, um, the female who was with them, uh, she got away. The male was chased by the um, male person. Uh, a short distance later, the uh, male stopped because he thought the person chasing him had stopped. Uh, at that time, he was struck in the face. Uh, it's turned out that he's now got a broken nose and um, uh, injured lip. The uh, male, the victim, then turned to run away further. Um, he then felt uh, in his back something sharp, which we now believe that he was stabbed. Uh, he has uh, been released from hospital. He's sustained, a, there's a single stitch um, that, uh, that has remedied that wound and he's with the police now. Uh, as a result of that um, call to the police and subsequent calls, um, there was a broadcast across police radio uh, for crews to be aware about this incident that had happened at Mary and Edward Street. Uh, a police crew coming down uh, Mary Street saw the person who fit the description. Uh, now this part is um, subject to the coroner's investigation, so I will speak in general terms about that. Uh, but it will be alleged that um, the male person um, has confronted police, uh, he has uh, been armed with a knife, uh, and police uh, have discharged their firearms. Uh, they attempted to um, provide assistance to that man, but he has subsequently died. Um, the, as is standard in all of these investigations, Ethical Standards Command, the coroner and the Triple C uh, have all attended the scene, um, and the investigation uh, will continue from here. The shooting and um, what happened in respect of that will be uh, under the control of the Ethical Standards Command, Triple C and the coroner. Uh, Brisbane Region uh, will continue to look at what led up to those circumstances. Uh, we are fortunate in the city that we have a significant amount of CCTV um, footage and we have officers looking at that now. We believe that uh, we've identified the car that the person came in uh, to the city. Uh, we believe that that person was in that vehicle alone. Um, we don't know the motivation for this um, uh, attack today, uh, but obviously we treat it very seriously and uh, tragically a man has died. But um, it's my understanding that what the police were confronted with today was a life endangering situation to them. Uh, and I'm very pleased uh, that they are alive, um, but it is tragic that a young man has died.